Hey guys, today we're going to do an experiment involving Yeyu Sacks Law. What you're gonna need are a hot plate, an empty soda can, cold water, a bowl, and some tongs. Once you've gathered all your materials, the first thing that you're gonna do is to fill one fourth of the can with water. Then, place it on top of the hot plate and wait for it to heat up. Once you've seen water vapor coming out of the can, it is now ready. Fill up your bowl with cold water. Quickly, turn the can using the tongs upside down and dip it into the bowl. So how did it happen? Before we actually heated the can, it was filled with liquid water and gaseous air molecules. As we added heat, it transferred energy to the liquid water causing its molecules to spread further. When enough energy was transferred to the water, it changes its state from liquid to a gas which is known as water vapor. This water vapor fills and presses against the sides of our can creating an increase of temperature. This is where we can apply gay lussacs law. As temperature increases, pressure also increases and vice versa. Now going back, when we flip the can upside down and quickly dip it to the water, the water vapor inside gets really close together, changing its state back to liquid. And as we've previously learned, liquid takes up a lot less space than gas, therefore saying that it doesn't exert as much pressure on the inside than it did when it was in its gaseous state. At this point in our experiment, the pressure outside the can is much higher compared to the pressure inside. And in nature, pressures want to be in equilibrium. The imbalance of pressure inside and outside is what caused the can to collapse, creating a balance of pressure. Thank you.